Hi guys, Kat here. Today I'm gonna make some pickle pig ears. So here are some pig ears. You can find this at your local Asian grocery stores. Pig ears. I got some boiling water going on here. Gonna add to it some a handful of kapha lamb leaves and lemongrass. And just go ahead and throw those pig ear in there. Okay. I'm just gonna add some sea salt. A big scoop of tablespoon of sea salt. Okay, and let this boil for about maybe half an hour. Okay guys, so this has been boiling actually for about 40 minutes and I think this is done. Uh, now I'm gonna go ahead and um, rinse it. And just gonna rinse it in cold water. Get all this out. Then we're gonna slice them up. You can do as you know as thick as you like, but I won't do it too thick. Probably like half an inch. Like this. Okay. So then you want to do all this for the rest of your pig ears, and then it's gonna look like this. Okay. Okay. So after you slice them, you want to go ahead and give it a rinse, a good rinse, about four to five rinses. Okay. Or until the water is somewhat like that, not as murky or cloudy. Okay guys, what I have here are leeks that's been cut and sliced and then soaked with uh, one tablespoon of sea salt to soften it up. Um, you want to soak it for about 15 minutes. And as you can see, I'm using mostly the white and yellow part of the leek. The uh, green part's a little bit chewy, so I'm not um, using too much of that. But you want to soak it for 15 minutes or until it produces some liquid like this, okay? And then after this, what you want to do is you want to rinse it with some cold water to get rid, get rid of the salt and also any of the sliminess from the leak. Okay? Okay, so we have our leeks. Now we're going to add to it the pig ears. This is about almost three pounds of pig ears. Okay? and one whole head of garlic. Also, I don't know how much is probably, okay, let's do this one. About two handful of cabbage and some fresh chili, okay? There, for the seasoning. Um, I'm gonna do one tablespoon MSG. Actually, I'm gonna do one and a half, guys. If you're afraid to use it, then don't use it. But I'm telling you, it will. Uh, the flavor really matters. But you can opt not to use it, okay? And then I'm gonna use tablespoon. Oh no, I'm not using um, salt, guys. My bad. Sugar. I need sugar. <laughs> and we're just gonna use a teaspoon. Sugar. Okay and one whole bag of this. This is uh, by the Lobo brand. It's called uh, the Nam Powder Seasoning Mix, okay? So one whole packet. Add everything that's in there. That, as 
well as this. Okay, and okay, pause a second, honey. <laughs> okay, sorry guys, I forgot about the water. So right here I have like four cups of uh, warm water, okay? I'm gonna add that in there. And we're gonna mix. Mix, 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 make sure your hands are washed and clean. <laughs> Okay, make sure you thoroughly mix it. Okay, now I'm just gonna taste this. Okay, that's perfect. All right, so once it's thoroughly mixed, you wanna put it into a container or a jar. <laughs> Pack it down, okay? And then I'm going to use saran wrap to uh, cover it. Okay, piece of saran wrap. Just put it on top. Like that. Okay, and I got enough room so if it starts to, um, uh, the, um, produce liquid, more liquid, it still have room. So you wanna not pack it all the way to the top, okay? And then close it. And then we're gonna leave this over the counter um, for a couple days until it ferments. Um, probably take about, depending on the weather, the weather, ew, what's wrong with me? Weather, it will take probably three to four days, guys. Okay, so this is Pickle Pig's ear. We'll come back and check in three to four days. Okay guys, so this has been pickling for three days, um, just sitting over the counter, okay? It's ready, I'll just show you the finished product. Mmm, you can smell, you can smell the pickle. The garlic, the garlic, and the leek. To eat this, you can just eat it by itself as is. But what I like to do is like to um, dress it up with some fresh chopped cilantro and Vietnamese coriander. And some dried chili powder. Totally optional if you don't want the spice, but this will really, really kick it up a notch. And if needed, you can always add more MSG or salt to it, but I don't think it's gonna need it, so I'm just gonna mix this up. Mmm, my mouth is salivating. I love anything pickled. Okay, let's give it a try. Okay. Get this 
piece here, a piece of leek. Mmm. Delicious, guys. Mmm. So crunchy, but it's pickles, it's sour, just the way I like it. You can leave it longer if you want it to be more sour. But this took three days. Temperature's been around in the mid 80s here. So, all right, there you go, guys. Real simple, very easy, and delicious pickle pig ears. I hope you all like this version of my pig ears. And please don't forget to share and subscribe. See you next time. Bye.